looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Purgatory is the spirit's jail. Built behind the blind man's wall. Catch the specter behind the glass. He repeats the disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Purgatory is the spirit's jail. Built behind a blind man's world. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore the darkened ruins. Bless the good spirits and give them food. Alas, we are coming for you soon. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Purgatory is the spirit's jail. Hello YouTubians, this is uh, Blue Falcon from Tracy Bows and Spectres and out here is the outside of the Renaissance building of where we're going to be doing the second floor tonight. Special thank you to Aldo for letting us uh, investigate his building. So like I said, this is the building on the corner of Victoria and Brody Street. Right now just waiting on uh, Shelly and then we can go inside. Bye for now. All right. All right, Vern. Very first name that pops up is a name called Vern. Debra. Debra. We have a Vern and we have a Debra. All right, spirits. So we have a Vern and a Debra standing here in the front doors. second floor behind me is the elevator we came out of now, the, now this is the hallway uh, right now the second floor of the Renaissance building and over there we have Shelly of Thunder Bay Paranormal hopefully you guys can hear me I am talking low because there is a meeting going on. Still. Alright. So. And here is Shelly of Thunder Bay Paranormal. I'm just trying to get situated. Alright. <laughs> yeah. Hello. She's I'm all a... tangled. I'm all tangled here. Okay. And we're not going to say anything about her being tied up. <laughs> oh, behave. Okay, that's what I wanted. I wanted the lights swallowed. Okay. As soon as I had my Alright, so. Language, I'm recording. Sorry. I'm a swearer. I'm yeah. Sorry. Yeah. You remember, you guys remember Shelly from our earlier things, where she was just quiet, scared of the scared of dark and spirits kind of person. And here she is now, swearing like, swearing like a sailor. I, I swear like a sailor. Now, the lights are on a sensor, 
in the sensor at the far end of the hallway. So. Are there any spirits here that want to show yourself in front of the camera? Anybody? <clears throat> now we know, I know you guys are here. So if anybody would like to, you know, make themselves known, you know, would like to tell their, tell their story by all means, go ahead and talk into the camera here. All right, it's me again. Now, sensor, uh, sensor on the light is going on and off. So I know there's a sensor at the end of this hallway. I am walking towards it. Okay, so now the light has come back on. And there's the sensor in the wall. So that's a mystery. Come around here. And for any wannabe with safe crackers, there's a big old vault. All right, so I'm gonna end this now and check it back later. All right, so I am currently here with a, got, it, permission to get into the Lakehead Intergroup which is on the second floor of the Renaissance building. Uh, you know they were kind enough to allow me to come in to do a quick little investigation. So I have my EVP here and we're going to start simply with asking some questions see if anybody's willing to answer. All right hello spirits. Blue Falcon here from Chasing Bones Inspectors. Is there anybody here in this room? If there is, by all means, go ahead and uh, communicate with uh, the light. All right, we'll just put that down there. So, I got the EMF and my EVP. So is there any spirits here? All right, well, that's it for this room. Okay, so my big camera's not working for some reason. Uh, this is Kelly, Kelly's here. Hi. What's that doing? Not doing a lot right now. Not doing much. Okay, I'm gonna run the Raptor. See if we get anything. So who's on this side? Uh, a couple of appear to be highwaymen or uh, old-fashioned businessmen. And uh, there was a. Uh, I seen a guy earlier. He had brown uh, pants, like tan, light brown. Okay. With big straps over his shoulders, like uh, suspenders. Wow. Uh, I don't know who he was, but he looked like a trapper almost, or a fur trader type guy, like a trapper in a way. So, and that would fit because there was a fur trader up here at one time. Hello, spirits. Doing all right. That's good. I don't know why my camera's not working. Yeah. 
behind the Cali. It's freezing. Yeah, it's cold outside. Asleep. Someone, someone's asleep. Who's asleep? Is John around? No. Yeah, John's around. Did John close the elevator on Blue Falcon today? No. It's okay. What, <laughs> bro? And why was it okay? Close the door. See. Don't like him. I don't like him. That that that's why it's okay to close the door on here because you don't like him. You're not welcome. He's not welcome. Oh. Why is he not welcome? Oh. He's fucked. <laughs> so it's okay to close the door on 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 Rod because he's not welcome and he's fucked. Okay. No, he's not a bad guy. He's a good guy. Oh, you don't like him because he's a preacher. Oh, well, I'm a preacher. You know, yeah, he's a minister and I'm a preacher. But that's okay? Oh. Here we go. Here we go. Blaine? Blaine's not feeling good today. He couldn't come. Yeah? Who's that? Who's that? You tell me who's that is. Kelly, you're right. Flower. You saw the flower? On the shirt? Yeah, it's a rose. See, the skeleton's holding a rose. Do you like flowers? Yeah? If you want to be on the show, you can make a shadow by moving by here. Yeah. Well, that's good. Is there anything you want to tell us? Some. Some? Okay, well, what do you want to tell us? Well, it looks like there's a spirit right there, eh? Yeah. Kelly's trying a new app. I'd like to show you whenever we're doing something new. It's uh, supposed to detect energy. Uh, it seems to be working good. Uh, so uh, I asked, I said, if, if they, uh, if John slapped the door on me twice today, he said, yeah, but it's okay. And I said, it's okay, why? I don't like him. Uh -huh. I, said, I said, why? Oh. Uh, I went downstairs and I heard, fear me. Hello, John. <laughs> Hi. Uh, um, uh, Shelly asked, are there any, are there any children here? Yes. Okay, we're, we're children are here. And I got one. Okay. There's also a Veronica. Uh, the Masons of the East Temple had something to do with the children. And a bunch of other things like that. Ah. And I said, I asked John, I said, why don't you like Blue Falcon? Mm -hmm. He's a minister. John. He doesn't like you because you're a minister. All right. I said, well, I'm a pastor. He goes, that's not as bad. I'm going to park up and walk like six times without being out there. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to go over here and uh, 
she's a child. Okay. So you guys got anything else you want to say? You got a lot? I heard grow up. You heard grow up? Do you have any messages for Shelly? Nope. No messages? I see you too. Did I see you? Well, you guys are awesome. Thank you for talking to us. I heard you're welcome. I heard there was nothing after that. Yeah, you're welcome. It was nothing. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> you're welcome. It was nothing. Yes. You want me to try something else? How about if I try my um, detector? Okay, I'm going to shut this off, Spears. I'm going to try something new, okay? Okay, bye. Okay, you want to put that back down in the bike for me? Okay, Spears, I'm going to try just for something different. Just to show the people, I do try different things. This is my EMF detector that I downloaded. We'll take a little walk and see if we catch anything. Uh, it does seem to work sometimes, but uh, let's find out. I'm going to mm -hmm. lean against the wall and just take a little stroll here. What are you getting? Something's moving. It's not you. No. Nah, if I back away, it goes off. Spirit. You don't want to, don't want me to see you, huh? Twice for yes, once for no. Do you want to stay hidden? Slight spike. Do you, do you want to introduce yourself? You do, you do? Okay, okay. Uh, what's your name? Want me to turn on the box so you can tell me your name? Okay, so there's one spirit here that wants to get attention. So, okay. All right. Okay, so we're going to go this way just a bit. Yeah, you can follow me. You can follow us. That's fine. Come on. Oh, that's a big spike for sure. Okay. <coughs> I see you. There's two people here now. That right here. Okay, thank you. Can you stop that for a sec? Can you back away for a sec? Thank you. Okay, come forward again. Thank you. Hello again, people. Okay, uh, the company uh, has left, and now we're going to try this again. I'm going to uh, try these stairs here with my Paratech. Paratech loaded. All right. Started scanning. You started. Emily. Emily. Okay, I just heard Sherry ask about children. Is one of the children Emily? Okay, I'm going to try the stairs here. Alright, spirits. You've been... Fear me. Fear me. Hello, John. 
Me? Fear me. Liberty. Liberty. All right, freedom. John, are you requesting freedom? Who needs help? Who needs help? John? Emily? Ice. Ice. Oh, I'm showing the outside. Yeah, there's a frozen world out there. Or do you need help in the ice? Who's in the stairs? Veronica. Veronica's in the stairs. Hello, Veronica. What brings you here? All right, Veronica. I'm gonna sit down here. How many spirits am I talking to right now? Is. Is. Okay. Three. Three. I'm talking to three spirits? All right. All right. But. Who else is here? I got Veronica. I've gotten a bunch of eight. There's eight spirits. Do we have eight spirits here? Why? Why? Because <laughs> I want to know who I'm talking to. Here to the elevators. All right, let's go compare notes with. Uh, let's go compare note notes with Shelly from whatever paranormal. Incubus. Oh ho 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 ho. Oh, that's a good word. Oh boy, does it ever! All right. Hey John, did you follow me up the stairs? And there's Shelly. Her. Her. Uh huh. You recognize her. Talking to me. Seven. Seven? You guys like Shelly more than me, don't you? I got a response when I said, Do mm -hmm. you like Joe? Afraid. Do you like Joe? And I got a blip on the thing. Uh -huh. I don't know if it was a yes or a no. Well, this is a big complex. Holy. I think we're going to go check in with Danny now. Here? Mm -hmm. All right. Any communication? Yeah. You, me, uh-huh. All right, so back to the stairs then? Anybody on the stairs? Who's on the stairs? No one? No one's on the stairs? All right. Tramp. Tramp. All right, you guys are just getting mean again, tramp. I'm gonna end communication. Scanning. Are you gone? <laughs> he's gone. Well, now he's gone back. <laughs> okay, welcome back. All right, all right. Stop. That's interesting. When I, it wants to say stuff but then see no see hmm okay I'm gonna try something different yeah okay yeah hit my chest again 
Okay, back. Take one step back. John, is that you? Don't you like Joe? But Joe's a good guy. You have something against me, John? Yeah. That was quick. Okay, point it at me. Hello. How are you? Nice to meet you. Good day. Point it up, bro. <laughs> 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 Hi, yeah, you two the end. How you doing? One moment, please. No, 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 no. <laughs> I apologize. <laughs> I, you, yeah, the, uh, I'm not wanted here. I'm not liked here. They're they're not communicating with me at all today. <laughs> like I've been to places where we have no evidence, but everybody else is getting it, but. Well, we just got evidence <laughs> just now. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I'm done for tonight because, yeah, they're not talking. <laughs> but they are talking. Not me. No, but about you. Oh, about me. Mm. You want a piece of this? Like, like. Like, I, I have it on video. Nonsensical words. I have my EMF, nothing. My EVPs, nothing. Everybody else? Well, that's okay. We love you. And yeah, I'm glad you do. Spirits don't. So, YouTubians and everything else you have seen tonight, spirits may like others, but they they still have bad taste. Let's try the one that uh, Blue Falcon always uses just for fun. Hey, spirits, you got anything you want to say? Death. Near death. Oh, who's near death? Are you near death or am I near death? Because I got news for you. I'm afraid to tell you this, but y you are dead. <laughs> Sorry to tell you that. To get. To get what? Magic. Magic? Well, no, it's not magic. It's just a box that allows you to speak. I guess it would be magic to you, but it's not magic. What year is it? Can you tell me what year you are? Past. You're, you're in the past. Yeah, do you know what year though? Joe. Joe? Yeah, Joe's around the corner. You want to say something to Joe? Did you want to tell Joe something? Relics. Relics. What relics? Relics. Relics. Hmm. About relics about hundred and some years. Are you talking about is the the protection he wears? Is that what you're talking about? Thirteen. <laughs> Thirteen. Oh. Nineteen thirteen. Yeah. 
That makes scary. sense. It, oh, you don't need to be scared. No one's going to hurt you. We're not here to cause you any trouble. We're just here to talk to you. Afraid? No, don't be afraid. We're friendly, okay? You got nothing to be scared about, nothing to be afraid of. We're not here to make you move on or anything like that. We just wanted to say hi and get some evidence of you. By all means, this is your house, okay? We're just visiting. You've been here a lot longer than anybody else. You just, you know. Yeah, yep, you've been here every time right from the start, eh? No, we're just visiting. Nobody wants to make you leave. Now, who's Harry now? Every. Oh. Oh. Yeah, every halt. Okay, you want to shut this off and do something different? Well, thank you for turning the lights on. That was very nice of you. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to stop this for a minute and we'll do something else. Scanning stopped. <coughs> Okay, that was some pretty direct answers. Oh, yeah. Okay, spirits. Oh, spirits. Could you please show me what a yes oh. is? Thank you. Go, go back to the, the center, please. Thank you. Can you show me a no? Very good. Thank you. Okay, so do you like Shelly? I like to know if you like Shelly. Oh, you do like Shelly. Shelly's nice people? Yeah? Do you like Callie? How about Callie here? Yeah? Callie's good too? How about me? You like me? That's a maybe. <laughs> That's a baby. <laughs> baby you like. Okay, baby's good. How about Joe? Do you like Joe? No? <laughs> no, you just don't like Joe, huh? No? Huh. Okay. So, uh, is it because it, is it because Joe's a minister you don't like him? Yeah. Is this John? Yeah. <laughs> okay, John, we get it. You don't like Joe. So, Joe's not going to be your best buddy, huh? No? <laughs> okay. That's fine. That's fine. But, uh, you know, he'd help you if you needed help, right? No? Yeah, he would. Uh, so is there anything else that you might need or want? Is there anything that we can do for you? Yes? Okay, sure. What is it? Uh, let's see. Would you like to leave some tobacco outside for you? Yeah? Okay, I'll leave you some tobacco outside. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you guys, uh, I'm going to let you guys rest and we'll talk to you in a little while. Thank you for communicating. Okay, so that was pretty good. <laughs> they just don't like Joe. <laughs> well, that's too funny. Uh, it's, it's funny because some places we go, they just love them to death. Other places we go, they can't stand them. So, I mean, it just depends what side of the fence you're on. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, I think that's pretty funny. Okay, we're going to take a little break and we'll talk to you soon. Yeah, stop button. Hello, spirits. I uh, want to thank you for having me here in your house. Is this a nice building? Yeah. That's good. Do you like everyone that's here right now? Somewhat. Who don't you like? Bro, okay. <laughs> Said Bron twice. <laughs> All right, folks. Here we are again. Just had a little break. That's my voice from Danny. Alright. 
All right. I wish to talk to John. Jo John, are you here? Okay, John. I understand we've had some problems. Now, I want you to know I feel your pain. And I'm not the guy you think I am. Okay. Okay, John. Yes, I am a minister. But I'm not the man you think I am. That man is long gone. I'm a different man, John. Okay. Okay, John. You listening? Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm not, I'm not the guy. Uh-huh, yes. I'm not. I'm a different man. My name is Joe. Yes, I'm a minister. But I'm, I'm, I'm not the man responsible for your pain. All right? I'm not the guy. Okay, I might look like the guy. Yeah, I look like him? Okay. Okay. They call me Blue Falcon. Okay? I'm not the man that did you wrong. I'm sorry for your pain, John. I'm deeply sorry that you're hurting as much as you are. I can help you take away this pain, John. Yes, Lund. Lund is my last name. Right. I'm not him, John. Yeah. Tell you what, John. Tonight when I'm home, I will light a candle for you. That light and energy can help you move on from here. Okay? I want to help you, John. Will you let me help you? I will light a candle for you. Allow you, you, know, you may leave. And leave all this pain behind. I don't want you to hurt anymore, John. Okay. 
I understand that you're looking for a target for your anger, but it's misplaced with me. Okay. So, it's okay that, you know, it's okay to let it go, John. It's okay to move on. Now you understand she was your world and that you were betrayed. But you have to let the hurt heal, John. Move on. Okay. All right. Yep. Okay, John. I'm going to end communication now. Do you have a deal? I'm going to light a candle for you when I get home. If you want, you can come to me and, and we can talk. Or you can move on. It's time to move on, John. Okay. Yep. Fair. Okay, John. Alright. I'm going to let you go now. I'm going to end this communication. Okay, John. I wish you all the best. I want you to go in peace and light, John. Peace and light. From Blue Falcon to you. Peace and light. Peace. Thank you, John. All the best. Well, I'm going to call that a success, boys and girls. Hopefully this works. Peace and light. Any communication. to tape in the dark, you guys. 
Okay, we're going to end this now. We'll talk to you soon. Close it up. Okay. All right, so now that we're sitting in the pitch black, <laughs> uh, see the camera there? That's the only light we got right now. <laughs> so, <laughs> and my night camera, for whatever reason, won't work in here. So, uh, we're going to end this now, and we'll talk to you in a bit. That's pretty cool. Yeah, my camera won't work. No? Hmm. Fully charged. Really? Won't turn on. Won't turn what? on. What? It won't turn on? Man, the spirits here just love playing with the electronics. No. Nope. Is that the camcorder that you're talking about? Mm -hmm. detector here. Won't turn on. What? The entire time I've been here. Oh, and what what happened the you know, with mine the, the, the last time we came here? Yours yeah. wouldn't turn on. Mine wouldn't turn on. Yeah, so it's kind of a pain in the ass. And there's no reason why it shouldn't turn on because I, no, I there's no reason it's fully it charged. So, so you watch, as soon as I get home, it'll you turn on. Reset. No, I'm doing a motion detector. Okay. I was going to say, oops, I'm talking. Okay. Ah, uh, over here. All right, my YouTubians, I hope you enjoyed this investigation. I'm, uh, we certainly had a good time. Uh, I'd just like to show you this is Shelly. Turn around, let's look at that nice shirt. Thunder Bay Paranormal. Thunder Bay Paranormal. See that, people? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's Shelly. And behind there, that's Kelly. Hi. All right. It's been a while since you've seen Kelly. Yeah. It was really nice having Kelly with us today. Finally, she had a day off, so she'd come with us. Uh, hopefully, the next time we come out, we'll get more of the crew uh, because that would be so cool. Um, I guess my closing statement was this was pretty good. And finally, finally, the spirits decided. Bra's not so bad. So that, that, that's a good ending to this uh, investigation. And I'll let Bra have a couple closing words here. All right, um, for those of you who've been watching, uh, yeah, roller coaster of emotions for me. I'm, I'm used to people not liking me after they get to know me, not, li not just liking me before they get to know me. So that was a, a bit different, but had a nice talk with John. Uh, from what I was uh, getting, um, he's now, you know, not as angry. He's still hurt. He is going to, you know, let the healing start. So, you know, good on that. Uh, again, you know, for the for those of you watching, thanks for watching. Uh, tell you know, don't forget to hit the subscribe, hit the bell. You know, share share away. Tell your friends about us crazy Canucks up here in Thunder Bay, Ontario. You know, and you know, peace and light and love. Okay. All right. Yeah, hold on. All uh, right. Okay. Now remember okay. now. Remember. Take, take care, care of yourself. yourself. Take, take care of your family. family. Watch out for ghosts. <laughs> and have a good day. Bye. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. So anyway, as you can see at the house. Why am I? There we go. At the house. Uh, had my, my camera working great. You know. Uh, it didn't work on uh, last night. And uh, yeah. Uh, there's just one thing I wanted to add to this uh, this um, thing. Uh, last night, um, Bra was able to make peace with John and help John to uh, consider moving on and stuff. And uh, so that's an ongoing thing that uh, Bra is going to help John uh, be at peace and, and be able to actually move on um, because uh, he doesn't want to leave him around angry because if you're left angry for a long time, you can become a twisted spirit. So, um, so that's one thing. Uh, the other thing is, I'm, I'm going to see if Aldo will let me and Bra go there one more time in the basement of uh, the other side. Um, for the simple fact that Peter downstairs, uh, he's another very angry uh, person, another very angry soul. So I'd like to go there uh, one last time just to uh, try to make Peter uh, feel better, to bring him peace, and to help him travel on. Okay, because... Uh, I, uh, we, we appreciate everything that Aldo does for us, uh, so I want to go there and, uh, and uh, see if I can't help Peter um, to feel better about things and, and to help him move on because Peter's a lot closer to being a twisted spirit uh, than any, any other one I've seen in a long time. So uh, yeah, no, he's not in a good spot and, uh, and I, w I would like to uh, make sure that uh, he doesn't become a twisted spirit. 
And also I want to make sure the place is clear and clean uh, for Aldo after his kindness and, uh, and uh, helping us out so much and allowing us all this wonderful investigation. So uh, uh, Aldo, thank you very much. I really do appreciate all your kindness and, and uh, allowing us the honor and privilege to be the first to investigate your place and the first to stay overnight. Um, that's a great honor, and, and, I, and I thank you from, from here, okay? Um, yeah, that, that was awesome of you. Thank you very much. And, uh, yeah, so I want to just make sure that Peter's settled down, and because and, I don't want you to ever have troubles with him. You know, in five, ten years when he becomes real nasty, uh, I don't want to leave him in that state. So uh, I'm going to go and see if we can't move him on uh, so that you'll never have to worry about him. All right? Okay, so blessings, everybody, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Looking into the paranormal veil Death waits for no one when it comes Purgatory is the spirit's jail Built behind the blind man's wall Catch the specter behind the glass disembodied voice. It all happens when the bones are cast. After death, there is no choice. Looking into the paranormal veil. Death waits for no one when it comes. Spirit's jail built behind a blind man's wall. Pastors and healers and shamans and poets. We explore the darkened ruins. Bless the good spirits and give them food. Alas, we are coming for you soon. Purgatory is the spirit's dream.